I was a little taken aback by the government saying that this is something that is new. We wrote them about that, We're coming up to a year, saying that we are prepared to do that a long time ago. It is not something that is new. The government was well aware of it. What is new is that Mr. Waite gave evidence yesterday that in fact we can receive payment by way of treasury notes in a way that would not affect government finances. And I think government was taken aback by his candor and his honesty with the court. So that this matter can be settled, Mr. Waite's evidence is very clear. It can be settled in a way that is not prejudicial to the commitments government has made to the bondholders and others. Let me ask this question. What deal was cut by NUCO with the government? Why they paid NUCO? Who benefited and why was that paid? What deal was cut with GDG acquisitions and why was that paid? It seems that government's position is that unless you come and cut a deal with them, you can take your judgment and tear it up. It is encouraging, in my view, corruption. If the position is that you cannot get a judgment that paid unless the government of the day decides that it's going to take a bill to parliament to approve that payment, it means that people will be lining up outside the Ministry of Finance saying, let's work out a deal. That is ruled by a man and not the rule of law. And we are asking this court not to encourage that type of behavior.